subscribe now and press the bell icon never miss an update all right guys today we are going to see how you can customize the shopify cosmetic theme all right the name of the theme is lamer assume you have a shopify e-commerce site using the dawn theme as the theme default you want to improve the user experience of your website by changing the design of it this video will show you how to accomplish it quickly and easily you will be able to customize your e-commerce store watching this video so let's get started i'm aws from affable studios to begin go to shopify developer program and login now go to stores add a store select development store type and fill up your information data When creating a store, always select the option Build a new store for a client. Press the Save button now. Your store has been successfully created. I am going to show you the default Dawn theme right now. Now I'm going to rapidly upload and publish our Lamer theme. After successfully uploading the theme, the next step is to publish it. Now I am going to show you the stores preview. By using the I button, you may see a preview of the store. Look at this. There are no images and products. Look. Don't worry. Let's return to the customize section where you can adjust the things. We will gradually customize our online store. The first step is to change the store's logo. Now go to the header 5. Scroll down, scroll down. Yes, press the theme settings. Now again scroll down. And yes, this is the option. Select the image. image successfully uploaded. Now select this logo image. Press the save button. The second step is to change the first large banner or slider which you might call a slider image. Scroll down and select the image you want to upload. Wow, it's appeared to be excellent. Now press the save button once again. Now move forward to grid banner text. There are three banner images with title. We 
we will upload photos one by one select image go back to the banner section select image for the second banner choose the image and repeat this step for the third one Superb. Now hit the save button again. Step number three is to update the parallax banner image. Scroll down to select a background image. Press the save button. Step 4 is to change the image of the next section. Which is the image with text style 3. Same, we repeat the step as we follow earlier. Now go back to the dashboard and preview the store. Oh yes, now it's time to import the demo products. Go to the dashboard again, press the product button. At the right side, look at this, press import button. Click add file, select the product CSV file. Yes, and press the upload and continue button. Now press import products. Products uploaded successfully. Go to collections. Select home page collection. And yes, remove this product. Add new products. Yes, calm soothing mask, mm, cleansing form, compact SPF and mm, this one and done. Now go to customization panel. And look at this. Now the next part is shop physician. And we will go to products tab to press cleanser. Hit the upload button. Choose this photo now. Press the select button. Move back to product 2 and press the lip care tab. Hit the upload button. Choose this photo now. Press the select button. Move back to product 2. Now we repeat the same step for mask collection. Now go back to clean the tab. Remove this collection.
write the name of the collection in the title field. Select manual in collection type and press the save button. Now add products to this collection. This one, this one and this one. Now close this tab and move back to customization panel. Go to cleanser, select collection. Now look at this. All right, we will repeat this step for lip care and mask collection. Now go to the admin dashboard and preview the store. Wow, it looks superb. Shop physician is perfectly okay. Now it's time to add an Instagram feed here. Press customize. Scroll down to the Instagram tab, right. In this section, we must need an access token from your Instagram account. We already do this. We make another tutorial for this. But you will get info from this link to set up yours. Okay, go to Google. Type developers.facebook.com Login with your Facebook account. Then go to my apps. Then first app. Alright, scroll down to Instagram basic display. Generate an access token. Yes, click I understand and press the copy button. Now paste this token here. Hmm, the news feed section is okay now. Press the save button to save all changes. And the last section is to customize footer. This is very easy. Go to online store. Then navigation. Press add menu button at right side. Write title of the menu section. Add menu item. Write the name of the menu. You will set your own proper link. We will give you the knowledge how to add link to the menu button.
Now press the save button to save all changes. Back to theme section, click customize, scroll down to footer 7. Now change menu to support. Now press the save button. Footer section is complete. Now we will check the preview of the store. The last thing in this section is pop-up image. Open customization panel. Go to pop-up newsletter one. Select image. Open pop-up folder. Select this image. and press the save button.